This ebook is designed specially for railway and SSC steno exams. A lot of contractions and advanced physiographics are used for speedy writing. For the convenience of students, this ebook is designed on A4 sheets and it is printable. We highly recommend to practice it thoroughly. You can collect the ebook from the link given in the description box below. The two senior superintendent of police, West Partner, submitted a report dated 4-11-2018, in which he has given the details of facts and reasons for aggression of the persons damaging the properties and also assaulting the senior officers, including their family members. In the report, it has been submitted that the administration identified the provisional constables and the permanent constables indulged in the wrong acts. It also appears that a report was also submitted by the town superintendent of police, partner range partner by report dated 3-11-2018, to the senior superintendent of police partner, in which he has also given the details about the incident in which several officers and other staffs have received injuries including they have destroyed the public properties. It also appears from the record that the senior superintendent of police, Patna, has constituted a team of town superintendent of Patna High Court, CWJC number 23925 of 2018 dated 3-5-2021, police, West, superintendent of police, rural, and requested them to submit the report and take disciplinary action against them. On the basis of the report, the Senior Superintendent of Police Partner by letter number 7747, dated 4-11-2018, gave the feedback to the Inspector General of Police, Partner Range Partner, and requested to grant permission to take action against 164 probationer constables and 4 permanent constables, whereupon the Inspector General of Police, Partner Range Partner, by his letter number 4022, dated 4-11-2018, 2018 has recorded that 171 probationer constables are found unfit and at the same time they have been found guilty of committing misconduct and four permanent constables have also been found guilty in the same term and directed for termination of their services in pursuance of the direction of the Inspector General of Police altogether the services of 164 probationer constables have been terminated mentioning that they are unfit to continue in the service and with respect to four permanent constables they have also been found to be committing wrong and accordingly all have been terminated from the service by impugned order dated 4-11-2018. In the present case, the question has been raised by the petitioners that they come under the protection of Article 3-1 within bracket 2 of the Constitution of India. Either the probationer constables or permanent constables, it speaks that before dismissing any person from the services should be preceded by the departmental inquiry and from the record it shows that the petitioners have been found to be committed conduct of indiscipline of higher degree and they have been dismissed or terminated from the service on account of those charges. So, it was required by the appointing authority, disciplinary authority, to hold the departmental inquiry and if the inquiry report found them guilty, then they could have been dismissed from the service. However, in the present case, neither any show cause has been issued nor inquiry has been conducted and behind back three main committee was constituted. Out of them, two have put their signatures and one has not put his signature, having found that they were indulged in wrong act of assaulting the higher officers, including their family members, damaged the public properties, including CCTV cameras. So it is completely a case of misconduct and admittedly no such inquiry has been conducted and as such, it violates Article 311 of the Constitution of India and requires to be set aside. If you have liked the video, hit the like button and consider subscribing.